In this video, we're going to set up some destinations. Now, before we can live stream, we need to put some destinations in. And it's all a bit different in version four. So I wanted to show you how you add different destinations in. And when I say destinations, I'm meaning Facebook, YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter, all these different sites that you can go to, different pages, groups, profiles. So we put them all in here first. So in this video, we're going to set them all up. And then in the next video, I'm going to show you how to multi-stream and actually choose between these destinations. But I like to have them all in here in advance. So I'm not going to the live and going, oh, now I need to go and set that one up. Well, let's put all the options in here first, and then we can pick and choose later which ones we want to come back to. So how do we get into this? Well, firstly, I'm in record mode at the minute here. So remember right at the top here, we could choose whether we were streaming, recording, virtual cam. So we need to turn stream back on. And you'll notice that because we haven't got any destination set up in here yet, there's a box at the bottom that says new. When I click it, it takes me in and it asks me about choosing the streaming platform for the first destination. And you see we've got some presets in here, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, Amazon, Instagram, and RTMP keys. Uh, I'm not actually sure what's under there. Okay, this is restream. Switchboard live and one stream live. So yeah, I don't know that you're needing these anymore. Now we can multi-stream from here. We'll talk in the next video. There are still a couple of reasons uh, why I would go to restream at the moment, certainly for LinkedIn. But let's pop some of these in. So let's start at the top and pick Facebook. And it's asking me to log into Facebook. So it's saying now down here, um, which account do I want? So it is Adrian Salisbury. Do I want to broadcast to my profile, my business page, or groups? So I do want to add my personal profile, and we're going to today have a go at going live just to your own personal profile. So let's add that in. And I don't need to add any more at this stage. In fact, this has just showed me this is because we haven't got anything installed, and it's assuming that we actually want to schedule a live right now. That's a topic of a video later today. I'm going to hit cancel on there. And I'm actually going to bring you in the other way of setting up these destinations is via these preferences in here. Destinations. And you see that we've already got a connected one here. This is my profile. This is what we just put together. Now I'm going to add some more destinations. I'm going to stay with Facebook for a bit. So I'm going to put my business page in. Add. And then groups. So groups linked to my business page uh, makes sense to me. So I've got my Adrian Salisbury training community. Um, <laughs> all my different academies. I'm going to add my Pro Video Academy group. So you can see you can add any of the groups that you run as your business page. If I were looking at other groups, then this will basically show every group that I'm a member of who have got Ecamm installed. So there's a ton of options in here that I could go live into. So I'm gonna stop at that point. And notice that the symbols have changed. That's my profile, that's my page, and these are two different groups that I would wanna go into. So let's keep going. My YouTube channel. Let's just log me in there. Twitter. I don't get a lot of um, joy out of Twitter, to be honest. I don't think we've ever had anybody show up when we've multi-streamed out and included Twitter. But um, hey, let's add it in. LinkedIn. So it's asking you here, choose how you want to broadcast on LinkedIn. Will you be broadcasting to LinkedIn as your profile or as your organization? I recommend it's your profile. It then says to choose the ingest server. It's going to say West Europe. Now, I don't have Twitch. Now, I'm not set up with Amazon Live yet, but uh, you'll see that there's a stream key, uh, help streaming to Amazon Live. There's a little information there if you need some help getting that one going. That's as far as I can go. And the same on Instagram Live. We're not set up with that one yet, but if you need help, there's a little button there. We can go over and there's a help page over there that will just help you get yourself going. 
if you're going to other platforms that um, you can use an RTMP key, then you do that here. And that's about as far as we can go. So that's me added in these destinations. At any point, if I want to add more of them, then that's how we come to it. We just hit the little preferences and work our way along to destinations and add them in here. So with all those destinations set up, in the next video, let me show you how to multi-stream in Ecamm and choose one or more different platforms to go to. So that's in this next video.